Well, you know, the students say there's been a lot to process. First the shooting and, of course, the aftermath of the shooting and then what's going to happen next. They came to University Chapel today to look for answers. Morgan State parents from Baltimore and New Jersey on campus to offer hugs and support to students reeling from Tuesday night's shooting. So I just came to offer free hugs because a lot of the um, children, um, students, their parents aren't here. So I'm a mom away from home. I let the parents know that if you need me to lay eyes on your child, just send me a text and I'll just go lay eyes on them and say I've seen them. Parents can't get here right away. Mm -hmm. You know, um, we met some young ladies from California. Mm -hmm. there's, we understand there's one lady from Australia mm -hmm. that's here. It was support that carried over into the Morgan State University Chapel, where more than 50 students showed up to pray for healing and reassurance. We'll be okay. Open my phone and I see that we're having a prayer service here. And I just knew as a child of God, as someone who prides myself in my relationship with God, I just knew I had to, I had to attend and I had to pray. Besides the prayers, there were other forms of inspiration from university staff members and fellow classmates. What brought you here today? Uh, honestly, what brought me here is I felt like I needed something to believe in. It felt like in this moment, I was anxious. It's just like a lot's going on. You don't expect to be on campus and the next thing you know, stuff happens. How has this service helped you today? Uh, it has brought me peace. I feel like I know things are going to get better within time, but for now, it's going to be okay. You receive your comfort. It just made me feel like I have a community here. I just came here to be with other people that experienced the same thing as me. Um, just praying for everybody that was involved. It was a safe place where students who felt uneasy could make a connection. Now today's prayer service here at the chapel was sponsored by the ministry Young Life. At Morgan State University, Tim Tootin, WBAL-TV 11 News.